Welcome to our visual how-to collection, where we will cover features, tips and best practices to help you get your printer up and running with ease. In this video, we will focus on our printer range without screened displays and how you connect Wi-Fi to these devices. For this video, we will focus on the EcoTank ET2810. For other non-screen printers, please refer to the manual as some steps may vary. Before we kick off, please download the Epson Smart Panel app, which can be accessed via Google Play or App Store. First, plug and power on your printer. On your mobile device, turn your Bluetooth on. You can do this by accessing settings on your device. Now select your Epson Smart Panel app and click on the plus icon to add your device. Here you'll be provided two methods of setup. Select the first option, Start Setting Up. Next you will see this screen, select Continue and then Next. The app will now search for your device. As you can see, the app has detected the ET2810. Tap to select the device. For this prompt, select Yes. Now you'll be presented with initialization steps. Please note this will appear if you are connecting to your device for the first time. For this video, we'll skip past this step, but we recommend that you complete the ink initialization step at home. As you can see, we have the option to connect to Wi-Fi and select Yes. Once you've entered your password, you'll see a prompt like this on your screen. Check the information is correct and select Yes. Wait a minute or so for the printer Wi-Fi setting to complete. There you have it, Wi-Fi connected and ready to go.